look at how cool is that physics watch the pros now you'll start to see it too they're the only ones who do it in front of you like this see this this is my scapular plane I can I can move best when I'm bicep curling do this you can't right go back further and try it right here that's what I'm doing so I'm using, taking advantage of every single thing. So I'm just doing a bicep curl on my scapular plane, turning. Look at now I got a perfect backswing. Turning back and letting it go. That's all I do. Yeah. It's even more. It's even more this way. Put it in your right hand. Yeah, yeah. Put it in your right hand. Just do it. Yeah, just curl up. Yeah, now turn. Oh, look at that. <laughs> what a nice backswing you have. You don't hit the damn ball with a backswing. Right. Okay? So go ahead, hit a ball. Everything we've learned now, add it all together. So you've got this turn. You've got left, right, Tai Chi. Every morning, 10 minutes. You've got bicep curl or hitchhike to your ear. It's just this and a little bit of turn of form. Okay? You come turn first and point, and then you extend. But you could think yellow ball. So that that's the same. Flipping it from forearm to forearm. Yeah. Okay. So those are all the concepts. You've got all the concepts. Now put them together. Coordinate them. Coordinate them, and you'll be a superstar overnight. Whew. So it was high, so what are you going to do to bring it down? You tell me. Zero curve. That's one way of fixing it, isn't it? What's the other way of fixing it? Turn more. You turn more, your hands go forward more. Automatically. So if you held up just a, a millisecond longer, you'll bomb the crap out of it. It'll feel like holding to you. It's turning longer, like an eternity. Is, I, I used to think of it like this. I, couldn't believe it when I, you know, was doing it. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, 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 wait. It's so far away. But when I played shortstop and I get a ground ball, I wouldn't think at all about tossing it to second and just react. That's why I added the other elements of reacting instead of waiting so long and perfect swings and all this nonsense. By reaching, you have three seconds. When you slide it behind the ball, you got three seconds to go, and your mind shuts off. So slide it in, and I'll count for you. Watch. Okay. Watch what happens. Slide it on the ground, and watch. One, two, three. And you will hit a ball like that every single time if you count to yourself like that. All right. Do it again. Same, all the same stuff. Go one, two, slide it in. Do everything you've learned. Conical. Hear it? So if I turn more, that's the reason I was Yeah, or move the ball back. You have a choice. It's up to you. But that's compressed. So you can hear it. See the difference? It's not clicky. It's thump, thump. And I do an extreme amount of turn. Yes. Oh, yeah. As long as I can. I can't hold it up. Your gravity is going to force your arms down. You can't hold it. Try and hold it up there and turn, and you'll see you'll have to release it. Well, point it the right way. Yeah, yeah, that's pointed the right way, not your left thing. No, your handle, I'm talking. Your handle, you're going to feel like your handle points out. Yeah, 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 that's dead on. Right? You feel like you keep your hands up there. Forever. Not feel. I do keep my hands up forever. I do keep my hands up forever. There's difference between feels. I've imparted feels with the tools. Yeah. So that you can check yourself and teach yourself now. You don't need you don't need me anymore. So let me ask you this. So you got this, right? Yes. Yes. Here, try working it down. 
and walk it like I did with little tiny increments with your spine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, now really fight it. Now bring your hand, to, with your turn, bring your hands up here. Watch what happens. You, it'll track. Watch. Track, track, track. Let it go. That's it. See how you come up real nice? So how do I go from here to there? You just pull. Turn. Yeah. But quiet. Real quiet. See? See how it's snapping from the top on you? This is bouncing. Watch. Do it now. But keep it quiet. Watch, turn, yeah. Okay, but it's more on this angle. You can drop your arm, the forearm, right? But yeah. So all you got to do is go from here, turn, the other way. See, watch, quietly turn. See, just point. Think of it as point. See now, this is now. Yeah. You so have learned. You've been. Point, and then it's yes. Now work it down. This is a great drill for exercise. Yeah, watch how it tracks. This is what I feel. I'm bending the shaft. See how the shaft bends? I'm using the power like of the shaft. Right huh? You feel like you're hitting here? Oh, hell yeah. That's where I do hit. My hands are in front of a ball. Think about the yellow ball. Think about the yellow ball when we have the other one. Your hand, your, 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 I'll show you to determine the low point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Work it real small and you'll feel the, how the core, feel your core fighting it. Really, do do little heel steps. Watch it rock. Use your little heel step. Oh yeah, yeah. Now you got to go. Now work it down. Move your hands forward. Turn with the turn. There you go. Now really work it hard. Let it go. That training every day, you'll be a superstar. You'll be hitting balls like crazy. And every club's the same, so it doesn't matter if we're using a wedge or it doesn't matter. If you have a ball, I'm telling you to keep your sternum there. If I had that yellow ball, hand me that yellow one. I'm determining the low spot by this. So if I want my arm up here, my low spot's moving way up in front. I don't care where this ball is. I'm still determining my low spot here and then letting it go to the here. So this is determining the low spot really. Okay? If I want it on top of the ball, fine. Then I release it dead on it. If I want it behind, I release it back here. So the reason that's important is because I really don't care then where the ball is. Who cares? So I end up, because I'm doing a circular thing and all the left, right, and all that, I don't care to watch. So it's off of my back foot, right? But my yellow ball would be here. So if I release here, okay, now watch. Okay, if it's middle, but I determine my ball's here, and I release up there, I can still hit it. Now, if I release it here, what do I care? So alignment sticks make me laugh. So what do I care if I've determined it with my yellow ball, my forearms, and I just change that angle, I can hit that target. If I was shooting baskets, I would never think. Catch me the ball and I'll throw it in. I don't care. So you're saying this, this is your... Yes, and it's unbelievable what you can do with it because now I don't really think about where a ball is. I can hit, I just showed you, I can hit a ball anywhere within my feet, the same, all the same. Doesn't matter, I mean, take one look, you got three seconds, you take one look, and you go, boom, Watch. see, how far offline was that? go like that see so it doesn't matter you've learned to control a ball by just changing that angle see usually I hit them so when I practice that's all I do and determine my low point and shoot free throws I'm shooting free throws now, I don't care which way you face or open or closed matter. 
I'm using this to control what the hell I'm doing and keeping the forearm up and just flicking. See? It's a bad shot. You did it perfectly. You moved that ball from one side to the other. So what's so hard about that? And now to add power, it's the same stuff. Just go left, right, and flip. Didn't do anything, but see how straight it is? Throw in the arm. No, it's, it's there's no throw. And yes, out. you just did it there. Yeah, it's alignment so and it's flick. Good. Perfect. Excellent. Hear it? Now finish it this time faster oh. to here. Oh. Your hand, your yeah, hand. Yeah. Finish it. Watch what it is. You can't stop it. You're going to finish. See? Now you're a superstar. Still think, that, yeah. Now you're not, and this is, you can't miss. Yeah. It's, it's there, yeah. It's now. And it's all driven by this. It's all this. Yep. And it's this. Is that where you get most of your speed? Do you get a lot of elbow. speed over the conical? Exten extension of the elbow and the conical, all of it. Yeah, yeah. What I did was learn each element and add them. And I don't the understand the conical one. Lately, but I, I, so if you carry I'm if I get these two to start. I'll just get you conical right now. Point it, point it down. Take just your left hand. Point it down. Okay, do it like that T. You're going to address it at that T, right? Slide it in. Okay, so you got to point it extremely low. Swing it with your left thing and feel it. Swing just with your left arm, regular. See how it rises? Do it again. Hit the T this time. Okay, now take both hands. Point the handle down, the ball's, yeah, perfect. Now let it go. Hold that angle between your forearm and the shaft, yes. And just feel like you keep that and then do it. And your, your forearm spins more. See, how it, it'll feel like it comes up. Like this? Yeah, yeah. So do it one-handed and come up with a nice finish. Yeah, you stopped it. Here. Keep your hand down. And then go to the same spot. Down. There. Feel it? See how it's come behind your neck now? See? Let it come this way. Behind your neck. Yes. Yeah. So let your... What's stopping you... You don't let this spin this way and up. You, okay. st you stop it. Your forearm goes to here. And then you... Stop it. No. Okay. That impedes speed because um, you don't have any brakes if you do it my way. I got it. The speed is going to be from, okay, right, go to the top. Go to your aim position. Right there. Your speed is from here, this foot, to this foot. See how this came down like that? Watch. Yep. See how it spins. See? Yep. See the conical? See the circular uh, pattern okay. of it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's no, look at, see how it's going now? Yep. Now it'll come up and around you like you can't believe and see how free okay. and beautiful it is and it tracks like yep. that. That's conical. Yes. <laughs> totally different. It almost pulled you over. Yeah, yeah, you gotta be, I know, I, I used to worry about that. I almost lost somebody once. He fell over, I mean. Pulling, you're pulling. Yeah, yeah. You got your hip thing going again. Just remember, think. Yeah, yeah. I left right with the spine. Yeah, that's so much better. You're so much quiet. You hear it? It's so much faster. It's so much faster. It's not funny. The cellophane wrap, and then this way. Watch, pull, and and, and sense the. See how that waves. You'll see it on. It's waving from the top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, that's too early. So watch, if you go quiet, go real quiet. See, there's no violence up here. So it's, you, it's almost like you gotta feel like this yeah. one. Yes, exactly. One motion, yeah, now see, yeah, you, you did it really well, yeah. It's quiet and then explode at the bottom. Yeah, you could explode, as soon as you're here, explode all you want. I tell people it feels like you're exploding from this foot. Well, the hard part of all this is that you're 
this is most people are trying to get all their speed out of the turn. And that's not where you're getting all your speed. Actually, that's where your pedal's getting all the No, I'm getting from all the levers. Yeah. I'm getting from a conical pendulum. I'm using everything possible for a 62 year old guy to kill a oh, ball. You can get speed like that. You, well, like this. But guess what? It's going to hurt hook. You're going to close that face so fast? Well, that's the thing. It's, it's, no, you don't want to do that. That's why that, I, I actually think there's more speed here, even if you didn't turn, right? So if you just kind of aim down. Yeah, no, no. Your speed's right, right? where you did, yeah. Right. When it's, you're here, now yeah. it's now watch. It's all this. So, yeah. so pose, watch. Watch this now. Now just extend your arm, okay? Yeah. Ready? Hold on a second. Here. Oh, sorry. Watch. I slipped. Ready? Go. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what I'm saying. The more you, the more I it's late. turn, the more I turn. The better you get in the straighter, which is the weird thing. Well, but, but, One but, foot of curve. But it's, but it's, if you think about it, right? Yeah, you got it. That's 90. Just ball parking up. That's 80, 90 percent of it. There you pulled down the other one you didn't. But it's a different different ratio. Do you follow me? If Absolutely. I most of my speed through this no. and almost none of this. No. It's let's just say 80 The speed this. comes from angular momentum. So if I'm a baseball player, this is how I was a good ball player. And what we did, this is how you're okay. Tucked, right? Now watch. I'm into the zone. I'm into the zone. Now I'm going to explode on the ball. So I'm teaching a baseball swing. I'm into the zone. So I should be thinking that same thing, right? Yeah. But guess what? I'm bent over. So what? I'm bent for the weight. So what? Just bent like this. Same thing. Really late. I'm in a position here I can't miss. Do it blindfolded. You won't miss. I'm into the zone. Yeah, that's the part I, for me to. You got it now, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Quieter. Yeah, that's pretty good. Quieter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you're in the zone. Yeah. You just did it. You just did it. It's all it is. The more I want to rotate hard, the more you bounce from the top. It screws this whole thing up. Yeah, you got to be quiet to the delivery. Baseball, you're like this, and what happens is you're here, you're, you're waiting. Yeah. But I'm not stepping. I can when I do long, when I hit my longest drives and it's going for it. I lift this leg up. Baseball. Yeah. You can see it on some of the videos if you really watch me, and I'm pounding them. I mean, ridiculous. And I'm doing that. Now, I learned that I didn't have to do that. All I have to do is lift the heels. So I'm here and. See, I'm jamming my heels. Yeah. One comes up, one goes down. One yeah. comes up, one goes down. Yeah. That keeps me quiet, and I got the weight shift already without all this lurching around and right. hips and ruining. Okay? So hit some balls, have some fun. Lesson's over. I can show you a trick shot if you want. Yeah, sure. So now, here, right? Yes. So you tuck the elbow back in. There. Yeah, don't, don't do it real hard, yeah. There you go. And the only other tendency you have is to get your ball a little up. But I already showed you the ball. So let's try the yellow ball. That was good, by the way. See, that you've improved so much here. Determine the yellow ball. So we fix your position so you don't have to worry about it anymore. Determine your low point with the yellow ball. So when you come down, watch. Go to top. You want to hit that T, right? So turn and watch the yellow ball. Turn, 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 turn. Slow, 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 slow. Keep coming, keep coming. See how the ball's now in front? Let it go. Oh, I went that far forward. Snap it, yeah. Not Let it here. No, no, no. Hell no. Go. Yeah. So now watch. Go to your back leg. Move here. Let's have fun. Move this, move this to the front. Now you want to hit the seam T, right? But you got it off of this toe, okay? Watch. You can still hit it, but what you're going to do is determine this yellow ball to be here and hit it and flick. Or you can determine your low point here for a driver. You could do that up there, but I don't recommend yeah. that. Yeah. You're going to go real high and spinny again. 
So you want the driver like back here still. But you determine with this ball where that low point is going to be. You're determining it. So go to your back leg. No, put this on the back leg. Walk up here. Okay. Walk up here. Let's see you hit that. So where is your low point? It's in front of the ball still. So do it. Hit, hit the tee. There you go. You just went over it is all. You still do the flick. Don't pull down so hard. Yeah. Quiet. Quiet. Yeah. And aim this thing right here. Aim this right here. Right there. Not here. Right, aim it right here. So and then fire. Right here. That's your aim. So you'd be aimed right at my foot. Here? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You from there you can Yeah, yeah. See you hit it. So with a ball on your back foot, you just slammed one. So watch. It's a real good swing too. Now. <laughs> you finally got it. Here, throw these down. I want to see you hit some. We're gonna do the same thing. Ball front, ball middle, like I did. So in other words, you're gonna have one here, off your toe. Okay. All right. You're gonna have one here, off the front. How is that possible? Look at that. How is he doing that? Because I'm Mo Norman. I'm the only one who knows. Okay, or the middle. All right, like that. So anyway, you know what I'm doing now. See? Watch. I missed that one. And the key for me is, is this hole. <laughs> and every one of those has zero curve. So put three balls up. Put three balls up, kiddo. And let's say you do what I just did. You don't even have to turn. Just put three balls up and flick them. But you're determining it with that yellow ball. So if I want to hit that still, I move the ball up here with my arm is all. Yeah. Flick it. How about that? Now flick it to your back foot. Pretend the yellow ball's up in front again. How about that? Did you get it? You did. You got it. You kind of missed. Yeah, the other one was better. The other one was one of two. Okay, put it way on the front foot. Exaggerate it. Now you got to get the yellow ball way in front, so you're going to have to do some manipulations with your arms, right? It's more than that? No, that's perfect. You got shaft lean and everything now. So just flick it. Aha, that one fooled you. Let's see you do that again. That was your pull down. That's why you missed. Do the little flick. Train yourself to hit it anywhere. You don't care where you line up then. That was it. You, you I just, want to, I want you, you want to come want down, yeah. So go to aim position and just do it. Go to aim position, target it, and do it. Slide it in, yeah. Now you know where the ball is, so go. There you go. Look at that. How about that? Isn't that funny? So why are you listening? It's not weird, it's proper. It's the proper thing, not weird. Theirs is weird. Well.